Covering Seminole County, Winter Springs police say they've arrested the young man who called in a bomb threat to a high school there. Our cameras were at Winter Springs High on Tuesday when students were evacuated and spent hours outside. Channel 9's Julie Salom Salomon is there now, and Julie, the suspect, isn't even a student there. And Bob, police won't say how they tracked that suspect down or why he decided to call in a fake bomb threat. But I can tell you 2,400 students had to be evacuated from the school behind me. Police arrested 19-year-old Kenneth Petrozillo two days after police say he called in a fake bomb threat. Students told me that phone call caused them to sit on stadium bleachers for nearly two hours on Tuesday while the school was searched. Did they tell you someone had called in a bomb threat? Uh, no, they didn't say anything. You know, after about an hour of us standing up there, eventually rumors started, uh, but other than that, nothing. On Tuesday, police say the 19-year-old called 911 but didn't say much. Just that Winter Springs High School had one hour to evacuate, and then he hung up. Bomb-sniffing dogs were brought in. Officials found nothing. I hear the bell go off, and everyone's like, huh, oh, this isn't scripted. This you know, so we just, uh, we were just very surprised. I checked, and the 19-year-old is still in jail on a $7,250 bond. I stopped by his home, which is about five minutes from the high school, to see if any family would answer. No one did. And that 19-year-old will go before a judge tomorrow afternoon. Reporting live in Seminole County tonight, Julie Salomon, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.